Hello, my name is Joshua Brown from the Interview Training Company, howtobecome.com, and in this presentation, I will teach you how to pass your principal interview. So if you have a school principal interview coming up for any high school, and you need to prepare for both the most common and tough behavioral interview questions for a principal job role, then please make sure you watch this video from start to finish, because I'm gonna help you to stand out and succeed. To achieve that goal, this is what I'll cover. I'll start off by giving you a list of principal interview questions that I strongly recommend you prepare for. I'll then provide you with example high scoring answers to those questions to help you to succeed. Plus, I'll also make sure to give you some essential tips for passing your principal interview before finally telling you how you can download further resources, including all of the answers to help you to prepare. And just very quickly, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel because I want to help you to pass your principal interview. And I can only do that if you are subscribed. And please don't forget to hit that like button because this tells me you find these tutorials useful. Okay. Okay, let's take a look at that first school principal interview question to prepare for, which is introduce yourself. Now this will be the first interview question that you get asked during your principal interview. And it is your chance to start positive and be the standout candidate for this job role. So this opportunity, use it to talk about the skills and qualities that you have. Don't talk about your home life or your personal life unless it's relevant to the job role itself. So make sure instead you talk about the experience and passion you have for working in the role as the high school principal and how you're going to add value to their school. A great tip here is to make sure you get a copy of the job description and focus on telling them how your skills are a perfect match for those desired. So for example, if on the job description they state they're seeking someone who is compassionate with great communication and a leader, then throughout your principal interview answers, be sure to use those exact terms and back it up with evidence where you've previously demonstrated that. So let's take a look at a brilliant top scoring answer to that opening interview question, introduce yourself. Thank you for giving me the opportunity to interview for this position today with your school. Those who know me would describe me as a professional, energetic and driven individual. Having worked in high school leadership for several years, I can confidently say that I am more than capable of not only meeting the challenges that come with the position, but I will also thrive as the principal here at your school. As a principal and teacher, my ultimate aim is to help students succeed academically as well as socially and to inspire them to develop into intelligent and thoughtful to adults. A great principal, in my opinion, is someone who is deeply invested in and committed to their school, who can employ creative and innovative methods in the classrooms to keep students engaged, and who can also demonstrate an understanding of and commitment to the wider community in which the school operates. In my previous school, my proudest achievements include overhauling classroom technology, making a positive difference in the local community through accommodating student-led fundraising initiatives, and, most notably, the opening of the SEN unit to support students requiring extra support. I'm excited and enthusiastic about the opportunity to bring my energy, dedication and modern approach to your school. Wow, what a powerful way to kickstart your interview and deliver a top scoring answer that's going to grab the hiring manager and the interview panel's attention. Remember, by giving a great answer like that to that opening interview question, introduce yourself or tell me about yourself, it will enable you to handle the rest of your interview and all the answers you give with a lot more confidence. So let's move on to the next interview question to prepare for, which is how do you define success? Now you are being asked this question for this principal job interview for two reasons. Number one, the interview panel want to know whether or not you have a comprehensive understanding of what elements contribute to student success at high school. Number two, you're also being asked this question as the interview panel want to know what your values are and how those values match the school's values and their goals. That's really important, just like I mentioned in that first opening interview question. So let's take a look at a brilliant top scoring answer to this interview question. How do you define success? In my view, success can be defined in a number of ways. Of course, as a school principal, the ultimate success for me would be if all my students hit the top grades across the board, as well as seeing them thriving socially. But of course, in reality, it's never that easy. 
Long-term success is attainable, but its meaning may vary from student to student. Some students will flourish at school, while inevitably others will find it more difficult. The sheer volume of pupils within an average high school brings with it a wide range of challenges. To me, success is measured by the degree to which I'm able to help each and every one of my pupils reach his or her full academic and personal potential. As your principal, I will commit myself to do everything I can to offer a happy and full educational experience to every pupil here at Fixture High School. Now don't go anywhere as I still have more interview questions and answers to give you, but when you're ready, click that link in the top right hand corner, it will take you through to my website, howtobecome.com, where you can download my 21 principal interview questions and answers for all high schools to give you the edge in your interview, including the ones that we're covering right now. Okay, here's the next principal interview question for you. Can you tell me about a time when you've helped personally a student facing difficulties? So when answering this tough principal interview question, you must demonstrate that you have experience of effectively supporting students facing difficulties and that you understand as principal, it is your duty to ensure that your school is an inclusive and supportive learning environment. So here is a brilliant example answer to help you. Can you tell me about a time when you have personally helped a student facing difficulties? In my previous position, one of my teaching team had approached me with concerns over one of their sophomore students. She was concerned that he was drastically falling behind his peers, having been one of her most capable students. After this unusual behaviour had been brought to my attention, I arranged a meeting with their homeroom teacher to see if they had observed any unusual behaviour. From this meeting, I learned that this particular student had recently become very reserved and was choosing to spend their time alone rather than with their friends. This immediately raised concern for me. I made it my priority to chat with him. Having discreetly spoken with him, I learned that his parents had recently made the decision to separate and that he was particularly struggling with this. I organised for him to attend twice weekly sessions with the school counsellor to help him to come to terms with this change in his personal life. Additionally, I made a point to regularly check it in with him as well as his teachers to monitor his progress. After several weeks, we noticed him reverting back to his usual happy and sociable self and a huge improvement in his studies. Okay, the next principal interview question to prepare for is, what qualities and attributes make a good principal? Now the interview panel want to know if you have the experience and knowledge of what makes an excellent principal and that it matches their school's values and goals. This is crucial. Again, just like the interview question, introduce yourself, use the job description to make sure that you match the skills, qualities and attributes that they seek for their high school. So let's take a look at a great example answer to that interview question, what qualities and attributes make a good principal? I believe that I have many skills and qualities needed to be a great fit for the role of a school principal. In order to be an excellent school principal, you must possess a diverse set of skills and qualities. As a school principal, you must act by example, being mindful of the fact that you'll be viewed as a role model by faculty, pupils and even members of the local community and must act accordingly. Additionally, you will serve as the main school representative and consequently, your actions reflect the school, whether that may be positive or negative. It is also essential that principals possess strong written and verbal communication skills in order to confidently and successfully interact with staff, parents, governors and students. You must also be a confident individual with strong leadership abilities in order to successfully inspire, encourage and guide your staff and students to help them reach their full potential. Last but not least, you must always be open to embracing innovation and improvement as well as providing your staff with opportunities to aid their professional growth. Your school can only maintain its impressive grades and excellent standing in the community if its leaders are willing to embrace change and involve with it. Okay, let's move on to the next principal interview question and answer. Can you tell us about your education and teaching experience? When answering this question, make sure you showcase that you have the necessary skills and experiences to effectively lead and support the staff and students in a high school. I recommend doing this by listing one, your academic achievements, then number two, your teaching experience, followed by your best accomplishments, and then finally, the type of teacher, leader, and principal that you are. 
So let's combine those four things to deliver a top scoring answer. So here we go. Here's a great answer to help you. Can you tell us about your education and teaching experience? As of 2016, I have held a master's degree in educational leadership and management from Northwestern University, Evanston, and a bachelor's degree in English education in 2007. I now have over 15 years of teaching experience, having spent the last six years as the principal of Fixture High School, Illinois. Throughout my tenure, I have been recognised for my fresh and innovative approach to bringing new energy to the high school. Some of my accomplishments include overhauling classroom technology, making a positive difference in the local community through accommodating student-led fundraising initiatives, and most notably opening the SEN unit to support students requiring extra support. I would consider myself to be a driven and ambitious individual and place particular importance on professional development. I attend regular courses and conferences in order to stay on top of any developments within my profession and I am encouraging of my staff to do the same. I know that I can make a positive difference in your students' lives by bringing a wealth of information, experience and enthusiasm to this school. Now in preparation for your principal interview, I also recommend you prepare answers to the following questions. How would you manage an underperforming member of your team? That's so important because as a principal, you are a leader. You are the leader of the school. The next question to prepare for is, how would you deliver constructive feedback? That is equally as important. What is safeguarding? Why do you want to work as a principal at our school? What would you do if you saw a student being rude or confrontational to another student? What is your biggest weakness? How would you build positive working relationships with your staff? Describe your decision-making process. How would you delegate responsibility as the school's principal? Describe your leadership style. How would you monitor the performance of the school? Why do you want to leave your current job? How do you deal with conflict between staff? As a principal of a school, is it better to be feared or loved? That is a really tricky interview question. So the next thing to do, if you'd like to download example answers to all of those questions I just mentioned, plus all of the toughest and most common principal interview questions, is to please make sure you click that button in the top right hand corner of this video right now, head through to my website, howtobecome.com, where you can download these slides and get access to 21 principal interview questions and high scoring answers to each question in a PDF guide. You can literally have access and the slides in your inbox within two minutes from now and it's guaranteed to help you prepare effectively for your interview and also more importantly put you ahead of the competition. I hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. Please don't forget to subscribe as I'm on a mission to help as many people as possible pass their job interviews and I can only do that if you are subscribed. Please also hit that like button as that encourages me to make more videos just like this one. If you have any questions regarding any job interview with any school please let me know in the comment section below and I can get back to you with even more interview tips and advice. And finally don't forget to connect with me on LinkedIn. I've put my LinkedIn link in the description below. It's always great to connect with like-minded professionals such yourself. Thank you so much for watching. I wish you all the best with your principal interview. Have a great day.